Chitraduga Fort, located across several hills, overlooking a flat valley in the Chitradurga region of Karnataka, within India, is undoubtedly an incredible site indeed, just like that of Kalish Temple and many other ancient temples and fortifications found across ancient India, was once perfectly cut straight from the surrounding bedrock, a feat which we claim was beyond the capabilities of those who some claim constructed them. The fort is claimed as being built in stages and is dated as having been constructed or indeed carved between the 11th and the 13th century. It was, indeed, we believe, simply reclaimed as the work of these rulers in what many would perceive as a power move, becoming an intimidating fortification for outsiders to have come and gazed upon. Claimed as having been constructed by the dynastic rulers of the region, including the Chalukyas and Hoysalas, later the Nayakas of Chitradurga, those of the Vijayanagar Empire. Corroborating this is the lack of utilization of the tremendous effort the fort would have been to construct, and that the fort, like so many other inexplicable ancient sites, was easily overcome in 1779 by Hyder Ali at Chitradurga, then later by British forces. The fort's name, Chitra Kaldurga, which means picturesque fort in Kannada, is also now the namesake of the town Chitradurga. Enormous boulders are incorporated into the ancient walls, with near polygonal masonry constructed around them. Built upon and into solid bedrock, one would have presumed that whoever built it would have been considerably difficult to have budged, even with incredible amounts of cannon fire. Yet those who claimed to have built it were seemingly quickly invaded and overcome. Furthermore, if one looks at other ancient sites across India, also carved directly from the bedrock of Earth, one not only begins to see the similarities in the builds, but the impossible perfection of these artistic visions, once having been so precisely cut, apparently with primitive tools. It is a site, along with the rest of ancient Indian antiquities, which are, in addition, not only claimed as the work of those who lived within the New World, but are yet to have been fully explained, it is a site which is undoubtedly highly compelling.